Well, good morning, campers. It's uh, the 17th of February. It's uh, 8.30 by that clock there. Um, I noticed on my little gauge, I don't that maybe a cup of tea, that uh, my humidity is at 50% here, which is good. Um, it's, uh, according to that, it's 20 degrees in here. Yeah, anyway. Oh dear, I'm up that bit scuddy more. We had a really blustery, windy, blowy night. God. As you can see by... I always got a piece of paper there. I get a little influx of water, just a few spots. But it blew last night and nothing came in. We're at the window. That's where I usually am pumped in. It's a bit, uh, a bit nicer than it did um, last week. All that bloody snow. There's the mast there where the, uh, where the red flag flies. Cause that's where the range starts at that fence. But there you go. Then I was, um, I was appert, I was appertaining today. Nothing going. I did notice last night when I pulled away that my number plate lights weren't working. I had the trouble about six years ago with them as well. I did a temporary fix and never ever got fixed, so I think I'll have, might have to do them properly today. But um, I've got some things to do this morning, and I think I'll nip down through and see Boxy um, later on the day. I need to go and get gas. Uh, that's about it, really. Yeah. I'll tell you what, you. I don't know if you think this is funny or not, but I got reminded of a joke that I heard years ago. I don't know if you were there or not, but it made me chuckle. There was these people in your Wales at Cardiff, Cardiff University, and they were doing a survey up the Rhondda Valley on bestiality. So these two young girls go to the first farm and said there, excuse me, I said, you wouldn't mind answering a few questions, would you? And the old farmer said, oh, and over that. And he said, well, it's about bestiality. And he went, what do you want to know, my lovely, about bestiality? She said, well, do you have any bestiality on the farm? And the farmer went, only with the sheep. She went, oh, she said, well, if you conduct that then. He said, well, he said, you could get one. He said, and put one of the back legs down your wellies, a welly, and he said, the other back leg down the other welly. He said, drop your trousers. He said, and you go on. Do what you've got to do. And she said, that's the only beast I'll let you do, you won't you? So I went to the next farm up the valley, and said to the farmer, and the farmer said, oh, yeah, only with the sheep. Put a welly leg down that one and one down that one and get on and do it. So anyway, day goes on. So they've got there anyway, apparently there's 17 farms up the valley. And they get the 16th farm and they said to the guy, like, you know, what happens? Do you have to ask a few questions? And they went, no. He said, we don't mind asking doing that. He says, on bestiality, he always said, I don't know about that. He said, we don't have no bestiality on my farm. He said, only with the sheep. Oh, she said. She said, then what with the wellies? And he oh, yeah, he said, that's what we do. And she said, she looked, and one said to the other one, she said, look, Blodwin, she said, there's no point in going on any further. She said, well, you can we get the same answers. We were like the other 16 farms. No, 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 we better do the survey, do the survey properly. So anyway, so they go in a bit complacent in the next farm and said to the farmer, do you have any beast alley on your farm? And he went, oh, yeah, he said, only with the sheep. And she said, oh, she said, what were the wellies? And, and oh, no, 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 he said. He said, I don't do that. She said, what do you do then? She said, he said, well, he said, I go out to the gate there. He said, and I stand there. He said, I get a pipe of tobacco. He said, and I just sit there on the gate going, he said, looking out. He said, no, we watch the sheep. He said, I just find myself a pretty one. He said, so I go in the field, get myself a pretty one. He said, I go up into the woods over there. He said, well, that little thicket. He said, I lay her on her back. He said, and I just tie 
her left leg over to the left side and her right leg over to the right side and her front right leg over to the, the right side and her front left leg over to the left side. He said, now I'd get my trousers down. He said, now I'd get on top of them. And she said, so you don't do it with the Wellingtons then? He went, don't be silly, my lovely. You can't kiss them like that. <laughs> You'll have a good day. I'll speak to you later. Stay classy, little fighting. Love you all. Bye-bye.